Another effector here is a push apart. The push apart effector is for uh, pushing away the intersection between the object if you clone them. It's like it's act like a dynamic but better than it. <clears throat> if we create uh, some objects here and I want to clone it and endpoint in any direction I need a lot of here yeah, as you can see <clears throat> oh, we need in a both direction and as you can see we have a lots of intersect objects here if you add a random effector to them and assign a good material to better sync that. As you can see, we have a lot of intersect between the objects. If you use the dynamic, <coughs> they will be explode. But we don't want this. Uh, we want to effect that, uh, calculate and understand the intersection and push them, push them apart. You can select the cloner and then push apart immediately if you select it as you can see and understand they intersect and push all of the objects apart and we don't have any intersection interesting if you go to the intersection you know the strengths and selection but the mood is very important the mood is push apart i will be explaining uh it acts the <clears throat> most important a setting of the push apart is radius it calculates the radius between uh, any objects and as you can see if you change the radius uh, it can uh, change the push apart effects actually if you want to little more as you can see uh, it does not intersect any objects clone object here Nice. With uh, this uh, radius, you can uh, change it. The iteration means how many times that this radius will be calculated to better understanding and uh, disappear the intersection between the objects. This is a push apart. This push apart the object. But another uh, mode is hide. Instead of pushing apart, it hides the objects that has intersect. Okay. It's hiding the object that has intersect. This is an scale apart. The object that has intersect scale it down to uh, disappear the to delete the <coughs> intersection. Okay, the object that intersect each other scale it down, shrink them to remove this intersection. Along x-axis, as you can see, it uh push apart uh, object along x axis to avoid intersect or along y axis or along z axis the best mode is push apart it is very easy <clears throat> and say it say it again please go back to uh, other lessons the previous lessons to understand the effector the former and the fields. Okay, thank you. Hello, my friends. To continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.